Hi. Uh, the reason why I'm making this video is because I want, under the circumstances, obviously I can't present my work in the way I would have liked to have done. I'd already prepared um, to print my work um, and also chosen a portfolio box um, that I was going to put my work in, as you can see. Um, portfolio box is complete with all the information um, for submission. Um, it's got my personal um, signature logo on it, um, which is also on my website and my uh, Instagram page and Facebook page um, that I've used to try and create the brand. Uh, now the images I'm looking at here, um, I've printed off and this is like my elimination process. Now I've got down to a final 11. Um, there are, uh, like I said, that is definitely, that is def that's definitely my number one image, number one. Uh, number two, I've gone with this one. Now number three, uh, I had a choice of two. And I tend to think that this one is the better image of the two. And fits better with the flow of the story. Um, again, number four. I had a choice two. And again, I prefer, I feel that's a better composition and fits better and flows better with the uh, rest of the images. Um, five, I've gone for that. Six, uh, I'll go on for this one. Uh, now, number seven, I've got 11 images here now. Uh, and I know it says to submit 10 or more. Um, whatever images I leave out, as you can see there's some more up at the top over here. I'm gonna submit these as extra images anyway because I feel that they're, they're, they're good images and deserve to be seen. Uh, now the one I'm struggling with at the minute is this image. And I'm not sure, I've, I'm just getting the feeling that it sort of disrupts the flow a little. Um, and I'm unsure as well as to take that out and just have it as a series of 10. Like this, as you can see this image, I quite like the image. I like the shadow, I like the fact that you can see the hands, but then you've got the small figure, which is showing um, the darkness diminishing. But I don't know whether, again, like I've had a bit of a discussion with Martin about things, and I don't know whether that's just saying too much. It's just, it's obvious it's shrunk. But the other images also say that that's that it's shrinking. So, and this is what I'm feeling. Let's take that one out. Move that one along. And there will be my final ten. Then again, I've got the dilemma, I'm, I'm unsure as to whether that one sits right with that one. I can feel that one, I can feel this one leading into that one, but I'm unsure as to whether that will be. And leave the shed out. Choices. For now, I'm going to leave them as it were. And give it a little bit of a, a mull over. And put 
black as an album. <laughs> but same again with these images, yeah, I have choice of three. Although I quite like the shallow depth of field in this one, I do prefer this. That, I, mean, I think that's the best composition of the three. Uh, this one again, I had two of these uh, with the, the blurred movement figure. Um, my choice was made with these two because I don't like the. There's a bit too much blur. I feel it goes up there. I'm not too keen on that. I prefer the the more central image. Yeah, but uh, this is how, you know, like I said, this is how I would have presented my work um, under normal circumstances. I've printed them all off myself. Um, I've tried to keep um, each image is um, approximately 8 by 10. Sorry, each image is approximately 8 by 6, not 8 by 10, 8 by 6. I've tried to keep them all a standard size so they all, uh, so they all, look, they all look pretty similar. Um, like I said, yeah, printing myself, and this is how I would have, uh, this is how I would have presented my work. Um, what I was going to do also, um, if I just move these out of the, out of the way. Yeah, I decided to go with the portfolio with the with the box and the prints and the slim. Uh, print sleeves um, because obviously I've gone through um, portfolios with the business module so I just wanted to show a different showcase to uh, my other work. Um, this is what I wanted to do. Um, I printed a photo book with some of my work. Now at the time I, I'd got a special offer with, with Zal Digital, uh, a company in Germany that specialises in printing uh, photo books um, and this is how I wanted to present my work as well. I was going to do both. Unfortunately the deadline for me to print this was uh, April so I hadn't completed probably these three images so I've had to put other images in there uh, but I just wanted to show what I, what I would have done. I was going to print another book uh, now this was about £80 um, but I was going to print another one with these in. I probably will do eventually. Um, but I just wanted to show that this is how it would have um, how it would have been. And these are like really high quality. It's like a acrylic cover, leather bound. Uh, as you can see, I think it's really good quality. There's, there's no crease there. You can just see the image. I think this is uh, how I would have prepared. How I would have, sorry, how I would have preferred to present the work. Like I said at the time, I didn't have the images that I wanted um, to put in there, but I didn't want to lose out on the voucher for the book. Um, so yeah, I put um, a selection of the images in to uh, to fill it up. But I think that's a really nice. Uh, way of presenting. Right, and that's about it.